In July, Asus launched two gaming phones, the ROG Phone 6 and the ROG Phone 6 Pro. And both these phones are powered by the latest Qualcomm chipset, which is the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1. Now, Asus is preparing to launch yet another gaming phone under the ROG Phone 6 series, and this one is called the ROG Phone 6D Ultimate. This is not the first time we are getting an ROG phone with Ultimate in its name. In fact, last year we got not only the ROG Phone 5 and 5 Pro, but also the ROG Phone 5 Ultimate. The last year's ROG Phone 5 Ultimate was different than the other two phones in just the aesthetics and the storage options and the rest of the specifications were the same. But this time, the ROG Phone 6D Ultimate is different from the ROG Phone 6 and 6 Pro in terms of performance. That is because this phone is powered by the MediaTek Dimensity 9000 Plus chipset. This also means that this is the first ROG phone that is powered by a MediaTek chipset instead of a Qualcomm chipset. The Dimensity 9000 Plus is MediaTek's reply to the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 and both these SoCs are similar in many ways. For example, both these chipsets are built on the 4 nanometer TSMC process and both have a similar CPU configuration. Both these chipsets have the high-performance Cortex-X2 core that is clocked at up to 3.2 GHz. The main area where these two chipsets differ is in the GPU performance because normally we have seen that Qualcomm's Adreno GPUs are better than the Mali GPUs that MediaTek chipsets use. Still, MediaTek says that the Dimensity 9000 Plus offers 10% better GPU performance than the Dimensity 9000, so it would be interesting to see the comparison between Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 and Dimensity 9000 Plus. As per Digital Chat Station, this is the N2 benchmark score of the ROG Phone 6D Ultimate. So as we can see, the Dimensity 9000 Plus scores over 1.14 million points. It is worth mentioning that this screenshot shows the CPU score over 290,000, which is quite higher than the 250,000 CPU score of Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1. But as mentioned earlier in this video, the GPU is one area where Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 might have an edge, and this benchmark score reveals the same. The GPU score of Dimensity 9000 Plus is around 430,000, whereas the GPU score of Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 is over 470,000. In short, the Dimensity 9000 Plus has a more powerful CPU, whereas the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1 has a more powerful GPU. And this is the reason why the overall benchmark score of the Dimensity 9000 Plus is quite similar to the Snapdragon 8 Plus Gen 1. Finally, some rumored specifications of the ROG Phone 6D Ultimate include a 165Hz Samsung panel, a 6000mAh battery, a Sony IMX766 sensor, and 65W fast charging. Since these are the same specifications as for the other two phones under this series, it is quite possible that the ROG Phone 6D Ultimate is different in just the aesthetics and the SoC. Anyways, that is all about this video and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.